Superman's gone. It's poured with rain. So the old mill beck met the sea again. The curious buildings up on the hill appeared to be empty and quiet still. Yet in the basement, a strange gurgling sound left some residents yearn for high ground. They uncover an exit in the archive. Into the cupboard, they begin to dive. Through an earthy tunnel, they stumble and climb. They'd not moved far in quite some time. Surprised up ahead, Tunny spots Aardvark's tail, poking out of a long yellow veil. While digging for ants to distract from gloom, Aardvark found a dressing up room. The discovery led to group celebration and triggers some playful impersonation. Bursting upstairs into stranger places, a gallery transformed into creative spaces. Inspired to seek out the actual seaside, human disguises allow steps outside. At last, the smell of fresh sea air towed through the park without a care. Crossing the bridge to get to the sea, birds on another mission to flee. Lovebirds reunite after ages apart. <laughs> While they're all distracted, Tony departs. In a flying machine, birds fly off with a grin, and Tony's back home for a bracing swim. Swept in by the tide at the end of the day, will they go back or set sail away?